What's up all my devil dogs? It's your boy, Sean Ollie, aka Mr. FSG, the Iron Five Star General. This song, uh, that intro song, Bands and Make Her Dance, very appropriate for this video that I'm about to record for you guys. I'm sitting in the parking lot waiting for my boy to come to the gym, so I decided to knock out this topic real quick. Alright, so, I've actually been getting a lot of questions from, you know, people in, you know, in real, in life, and emails even, even messages. So, I've gotten a couple of dudes, younger dudes, you know, in their teens, um, and they're like, well... Will bodybuilding or like fitness and getting into shape, will that get me more girls? And even for girls, will it help guys be attracted to me, all right? So first, let me just knock it out. When you look good, when you're fit and you're in shape, you're gonna get more attention than when you're not in shape, all right? Um, good example is when I went to Bush Gardens a few weeks ago, you know, I wore my tank top or whatever and like, I was getting looks from everywhere, you know, and I was just, I actually didn't feel like I was even looking that great, but you know, when you have a, a physique that's better than the average, then people are going to notice you and people are going to look at you. Um, but uh, not to, not to, you know, burst your bubble because if you can look good, but um, that's just going to open doors for you. It's not going to seal any deals. All right. Looking good is just, I mean, that's. I probably about 70% of the battle, all right? You got to be able to hold a conversation, all right? Let's address girls first because girls are easy. Girls, if you look good, truthfully, that's pretty much 90% of the battle, 90 95%. Because even guys, they might be like, oh, this girl is stupid or this girl, is, she got no brains, but she looks good. So I'm going to try to talk to her anyway. There's a lot of guys like that. So as far as if you look good and you're not exactly the smartest, you're still going to get guys. You're probably not going to get anything too long term. You know, unless you get a guy who's also kind of, you know, one uh, corn flick short of a box. You know what I'm saying? So, for girls, most of the time, if you look good and you're intellectual, whew, uh, you're, you're, uh, you're prime pickings. But, you know, you're going to be able to pick the guy that you want because, um, you know, you're not only, you don't only look good, but you're also smart. Now, guys, all right. Let me tell you something about girls. Girls, they care about looks not nearly as much as we do, all right? When uh, you can look good or whatever, right? And that's going to win you their attention, right? Uh, what's the movie, man? I, I believe it was uh, Django where, uh, what's the name? Uh, DiCaprio. He's like, uh, you had my curiosity. Now you got my attention or whatever. So your body's going to get them curious. But if you got a good body and, you, you know, you can hold a conversation, you know, you're at least a little bit intelligent, then you're going to get their interest, all right? So for guys, it's a lot harder. Looking good does not do you as much good as it does for girls because guys, we're kind of shallow, honestly, and we'll go after a girl even if she's not even that smart just because she looks good. Girls will be like, oh, he looks good, but he's dumb as rock. So truthfully, I mean, it's whatever. You know, maybe if they catch you at a bar or something, they might try to hook up with you. But other than that, if you expect something long term, yeah, I I wouldn't, you know. So, but at the end of the day, guys, um, just looking good is not going to cut it. Because I'll tell you one thing. I know plenty of guys who are not in shape or, you know, they're, they just look average or whatever. But you know what? They're confident. You know what I'm saying? Confidence is key in anything. Whether you're a guy or a girl, if you're confident, especially if you're a guy, especially if you're a guy, you got to be confident, man. If you're not confident, then it doesn't matter how damn good you look. You know, if you're shy, but you're a big dude and, you know, you're in shape, but you're shy, I mean, you're never going to approach a girl in the first place. And let me tell you right now, nowadays, girls are not approaching you. If a girl approaches you nowadays, she's either a cougar or she's just one of the very rare girls who just goes after what she wants. Which I like those type of girls, but let's be real. There's not very many of them out there. So you have to know how to talk to girls. You have to know how to hold a conversation. And you can't be nervous because girls smell that like blood in a water to a shark. You know, if, you, if you're nervous at all, you're kind of, uh, they're going to know. All right. So, but guys, you just got, that's when you got to be alpha, man. You got to be an alpha male. Alpha as fuck. All right. You got to go out there and you got to, you know, just. Go talk to some girls, man. Look, you're going to get more no's than yeses no matter how damn good you look. Unless you're like Brad Pitt or, you know, Tyrese Gibson or somebody. You know what I'm saying? But they also have money. You got money. Money talks. No matter how you look, if you got some money, you could find some girls. But like I said, it ain't going to be nothing real. 
All right, if you want to find you a real girl, I mean, look good because that's going to get you, that's going to open a lot of doors for you, but also have some intelligence and some confidence. All right, don't want to make this video too long. Just thought I'd address that real quick while I'm waiting in the parking lot. Don't forget the orders, subscribe and share, like and comment, and until next time on my devil dogs, dismiss. Good thing is, no torn meniscus, no torn ACL, no torn, no torn MCL, which is what I thought it might be. No, no, none of the major ligaments are torn. So pretty much what Doc said, right? My knee, right? You know how your knee's like in a groove or whatever? Right, so my knee pretty much shifted out 